Hey, what's up, you guys? Today, we're going to be talking about my new book. Ah! I'm getting hot, and I'm not very good at impressions. I'm going to need my glasses on. Hey, guys. Um, today, I'm going to talk about Shane Dawson's book. It's called I Hate My Selfie. I'm more of a, like, a recent fan of Shane Dawson. Um, I've known about him for quite a while, but one day recently, I just decided to look him up on YouTube. I typed in Shane, and luckily, it came up right away. I couldn't remember his last name. It was the video where he tries weird girl products, and I was laughing so hard. Um, and I just kept watching more videos after that. And at one point, he had said that he is a New York Times bestseller, and I was like, oh, okay. Um, so I actually looked it up on Amazon, and I ordered it. I was laughing from page one. Uh, I love this book. It's very, very, very funny. I don't know if I've laughed so hard at a book in my entire life. Um, it's a it's a collection of like a lot of like embarrassing things that have happened to him, like things about him growing up, but like humorous situations. And there was actually one chapter that made me cry. It was a chapter about his grandma, um, about his grandma passing away. And you know, through watching, you know, several of his videos, you know, I could tell that you know his, you know, he jokes about his grandma and stuff, but you know that they were really close and. You know, that's something I really admire because my grandparents passed away before I even got a chance to really get to know them. So I kind of live vicariously through other people um, and their experiences with their grandparents. But, you know, the beginning of the chapter, I was like cracking up. And then as I read on, I was like at work reading it and I started to like cry. He talked about, you know, his experience on the set of Smiley, which is a movie that he was in a few years ago. He talked about poop a lot and diarrhea a lot. That's my definitely my kind of humor. Um, he talks about his body, um, like his body issues. And so many people in this world today struggle with their weight, struggle with self-esteem and self-worth. And I feel like this, this book could definitely like help people as well. What I really liked about the book is, you know, when you see these YouTube personalities, you see them, I feel like some people don't, realize that these personalities are actually human beings. They have feelings. They're just like everybody else. They have, you know, ups and downs. This book, you know, it really kind of made you know that Shane Dawson is a real person. He has, you know, the same kind of stuff that he goes through all the same kind of stuff that, you know, everybody else does. And, you know, it's important to remember that regardless of, of YouTube status, that everyone's a person and you know, everybody has gone through stuff, and you may not even realize it, but, you know, everyone has their own personal demons, and I, I feel like I learned a lot about him, and he's definitely somebody I would totally want to hang out with. Even though it's, like, a humorous book, it could definitely, I re definitely recommend it. I actually bought a copy for my nephew. He's 13, <laughs> but I, I want him to read it. Well, I think, I think it was awesome. I, I love the book, and as soon as I finished reading it, I was like, I want to read it again, and I want to read more. I really hope that you know, Shane writes more books. Hashtag sponsor, but not really. I wish, I wish you would sponsor me. And congratulations on New York Times bestseller list. Uh, the beginning of each chapter has drawings drawn by, drawn by his fans. I think that's really cool. It's a really way to, good way to connect with your fans. They'd be like, oh, you know, I'm writing this book and, you know, I'd love to incorporate, you know, fan art. Um, I think that's awesome because you know, so much of, of people, so much of the people on YouTube, you know, are where they are right now because they have subscribers, because they have fans. I could definitely, I definitely could hear Shane reading it um, in my head. So he, he writes like how he speaks. Yeah, I, I feel like I could, I could relate to Shane um, in, in a lot of ways, actually. But, you know, I wish that, you know, I'd known him growing up, so I feel like we would have been good friends and he, he definitely has a unique sense of humor. If you've never seen his videos, I think that you should, you know, give one a try. You know, you might, you might find something that you really like. And he does a lot of collaborations as well. So you might find someone in his collaborations that, that interest you as well. And I just want to say that I took time to do these, um, like, deer things like Shane has at his old house. He doesn't have it at his new house, I don't think. And I spent the time to write Medieval Times on my shirt because Shane always wears that medieval time shirt and it didn't even matter because you can't even really see it in the video at all but I want to say thank you for watching 
check out I Hate Myself. If you if you like to laugh, if you like um, vulgarity, uh, I definitely think this is the book for you. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe, because I'm making videos every day. Bye!